I had all these like, I had all these, I still had these voices in my head, but they weren't as severe as before. I was really worried about going back to school. I didn't have a, a nice upbringing. I got put in foster care. I grew up with a learning disability. My depression was very bad and my anxiety was bad. I wanted to commit suicide so many times. The GP put me on tablets as well to get my anxiety down. To the state of where I wouldn't get out of bed. So many uh, times. I wouldn't leave the flat and it just basically paralysed me. To begin with, you're quite ambivalent about setting goals, wasn't you? Yes. So I how does it feel looking at this and thinking, wow, I've actually achieved that? Yes, it's good. It's, yeah? It feels good, yeah. Yeah, fantastic. Well done, David. I feel better now. Yeah, I feel better. I feel a lot better. But I still miss this place, though. I have some memories here. I'm very happy to see you. I think I've become so much more open and I find it so much easier to talk about my emotions now. I've built up my life around what does make me happy and what does make me want to keep going. Hello. How are you? Mm. I thought you were a very nice girl, but a difficult one. Very difficult. Mm. Yes, yeah, very difficult. And now I find out that I'm on the earth to make people happy and have fun times. So I'm happy that I'm still here today. I'm good at all camps because we're Sam, she's caring, loving. She has helped me re like a lot. She's like, she's put me on the right track. My mum and dad couldn't believe it when I started working with Mornsley. Mum started to cry when I got my badge and I was really happy as well. I think he's definitely got more confident and I think he's kind of matured actually as well. I'm really proud of Kay. She has done so, so well. And now she's really found something that has real meaning for her. She's flying. She's, she's off. <laughs> Two shots for me now. Yeah, yeah. Alex is, yeah, just helpful. He's just, he's just very, um, like an uncle, you know, just there to help, you know. I would just like to thank Nikki for the help and support that she's given me and uh, that I'm sadly going to miss her. Yeah. Dr. Maria believed that I could do it. She's funny, she's tiny, and she always has time to listen to people. I will never forget her. I rate the Maudsley really highly and all their staff because it's honestly changed my life and I just wouldn't be where I am now without them.